Cost minimization is a way of solving the optimization problem regarding the utility function and the budget constraint, concentrating on minimizing expenditure for a given level of utility. This is the general equation to formulate cost minimization. It is read as the minimum price P of the amount bought X subject to the utility that derives from the good such that it fulfills the amount of utility we want to achieve from it, U bar. This equation is a generalization, and therefore it is easier to understand this optimization problem when dealing only with two goods. Thus we modify our general equation. In this new equation, we see that we try to minimize the cost of buying goods x1 and x2, such that we achieve an amount of utility which is at least as big as the amount of utility we seek, here u bar. This second formula is commonly used in order to facilitate its graphical representation. The x-axis, or horizontal axis, shows the amount of good x1 consumed, while the y-axis, or vertical axis, shows the amount of x2 consumed. The line represents a cost function. It joins different bundles that have the same cost. In theory, any bundle that lies inside or on this line can be chosen. The lines that are set downwards represent a lower amount of spending, where the smallest total cost is given by the shortest line. It is quite obvious that anyone would rather spend less than more, thus choosing the smallest cost possible. However, what we are trying to achieve is to reach a specific amount of utility. Although this level of desired and fixed utility can be fulfilled with different cost functions, we will want to choose the lowest possible one so that it minimizes our cost. As we can see, we could choose different cost functions. However, there is only one that meets both conditions of lowest budget and reaches the desired utility level. This optimization solution will be located at the exact point where the budget constraint line is tangent to the indifference curve. It must be noted that in the case shown, given the properties of the budget constraint and the utility function, one and only one solution is possible. The bundle of goods that minimizes cost while complying with the desired level of utility will be composed of the equilibrium amount of good 1 and the equilibrium amount of good 2. At this point, the price of the first good divided by the price of the second one, which is the slope of the budget constraint, will be equal to the marginal rate of substitution, which is equal to the slope of the indifference curve. This optimization problem must be seen as one of two sides of a coin, called consumption duality. Indeed, a similar but opposite analysis can be done solving the primal problem, the utility maximization problem. It is also worth saying that cost minimization is associated with Hicksian demand curves.